Hello everyone, Luke for Smithy. It is Tuesday, the 18th of May, and today's review is going to be of Lost Jungle in London. Well, not in London, it is actually in Eggware, which is just outside of Watford. Actually, it's on. I actually got, got, got it up on the, um, on Google Maps. It's actually saying like Wat Watford Bypass at Eggware. So, um, it is a mini golf course. Um, I think it's got something like um, two sets of 18 holes. It's got plenty, plenty of holes. Giggly. I think it's like 32. No, 36. I can't, I can't remember how many. Uh, I'm not that. I'm not. I'm not that good with math. With math. But anyway, I'm gonna flash up some pictures now. And um, yeah, very nice golf course. We um or mini golf course. We did. I basically went there on um, last Monday of, of my week off. Um, unfortunately, it, it did actually rain. It, did, it was basically on and off. For the most part, it was absolutely fine. So the weather did not really af af affect it as much. But we did, basically we did, did the full set. Um, which was like the 36, 38 holes. I, I can't remember how, how many exactly there is i i actually left a scorecard downstairs i should have brought it up really um really nice theming i've got got to say re great great theming there are some like wear and tear in some areas um however it is outside and it is out in the elements so uh, you, you can't really expect itself to be kept kept in like tip-top con condition like if it's out outside and it's got hail and rain and snow there, there will be some wear and tear but other than that like for the most part it's great Re really good experience the um theming there was like two like two courses um basically one was um i think one's like congo and one was like the amazon and they were like themed like like amazon sort of theming for, for the main part and they're uh, the actual holes, like the actual um, greens themselves, were each individually themed. Like the first few was pretty standard ones, and then it just then it got more unique. The, the, the more you got up to, and like the more like obstacles you had, you had to do, the, the more holes you actually do. Um, I'm gonna put a link in the description to their website. This isn't a plug. This is basically me talking about it so this is not a sponsored video um yeah i i really enjoyed it I mean, it was really nice to have to have a day out and it was really really good to do crazy golf again or miniature golf it's actually saying on here um i think the, the, the last time i actually did um mini golf was um i think it was either at Alton Towers or in um, Brighton, what one or two? I can't remember which one was the, the, the latest one I did, but it, it was one, one of them two. Um, so yeah, um, they all probably um, went off now, but I did actually show some um, some pictures that I've taken. Um, I also put an album on Facebook as well. So yeah, it's, it's re re really worth it. Um, unfortunately, I have forgotten the price of the. Um, yeah, I kind of forgotten the um, price on on here, but um, it'll be on the um, re website um, if if it is. Um, so let's see where else there is other things to do um, there, which is. Um, foot golf like football golfing where you can kick, kick a ball in, in, into a hole however that's an upcharge so, so we didn't really do do that one um but other than that really good experience R really nice day out as well quite, quite enjoyed it like i said before I, lo I, I love a bit of mini golf and um there is one that i want to do um, kind of forgot where it is, but I do know it's it's lo local to me, and I do do want to do um, that one. It's actually new. The, the, the next one I want to do. Um, so what I'm going to do now, I'm going to get this edited, 
and I'm gonna upload it as soon as I can but this will be up today so I'm gonna edit it all together and um, upload it and I'll see you guys in another video